Dr. Gigi here with Deandra, and on this video we're going to show you how to do the L5 spondylo exercise. If you have this exercise as one of your recommendations, then there's one of two things that is happening. Either you have hyperlordosis, which is basically when the lower back is curving more than what it needs to, causing tension, or you might have something called spondylolisthesis, where it is when the one bone of your lumbar spine shifts and goes forward compared to the other. In this situation, you're gonna to wanna to do the L5 spondyl exercise, and you do it on a yoga mat, on a carpet, on the floor, or you can even do it in your bed as long as your bed is firm. You're gonna start out laying down, and we're gonna start with some stretches. First, you're gonna bring one of your legs up, you're gonna bring them towards your chest, and you're gonna hold that for 10 seconds. Once that's done, you're gonna to go to the other side and do the same thing with the other leg, bring it close to your chest, and hold for 10 seconds. After that, you're going to bring both of your legs up. Now hold it towards your chest again, 10 seconds. Once you're done with this, you're ready to do your exercise. So you're going to keep your knees bent. And then for this one, you're going to make sure to have your back all the way touching the floor. So you're going to try to draw your belly down into the floor. And then you're going to tuck your pelvis just like that. Once you get into that position, you're going to hold that for 10 seconds. And you're going to do that 10 times. Most likely you're gonna be doing this morning and night unless something else is listed on your care plan. So there you have it, this is the L5 spondylo exercise.